Assalamu alaikum have a good day welcome to financial management e learning today we will discuss the monetary policy system for the year 2020 and 21 we all know that bangladesh bank has declared the monetary policy statement for the fiscal year 2020 and 21 we will discuss only for the highlights of mps so one thing clear here that the prime objectives of the monetary policies are the economic recovery along with maintaining dual goals of price stability and quality growth so all the uh, newspapers and media we have seen it and uh, there are monetary policy statements the basic highlights we have seen already you know the bank rate now four percent proposed from the five percent repo rate 4.75 percent from 5.25 percent reverse repo rate four percent from 4.75 percent broad money target 13.5 percent private sector credit growth target 13.8 percent and also you know the current account balance target used to 4.9 billion this bank monetary policy and policy terms remain in the uh, growth suffered without tampering inflation target of 5.4 percent and Bangladesh Bank purpose to cut in overnight to wrap rent from 5.25 percent to 4.75 percent to make funds available to banks at a cheaper price maybe 17 years bank rate was unchanged now it proposed for four percent from the five percent so monetary policy plus risk factor in the terms of covid 19 price volatility global economic bloods and cyclone and projected output growth is found to be on target of its situation improves and global and drastic economic recovers in financial at 21 the inflation range to be 5.04 percent to 5.93 percent and defect in current account balance expected to slightly downgrade and uh, admits that remittance might not be sustainable and if NPL cannot reduce it would have a long-term bad impact expected a struck to rebound in view support monetary policy money velocity may fall further and public sector credit extended by 44.4 percent and private credit by 14.8 percent gdp growth target is set as 8.2 percent and despite the growth decline 5.2 percent in the finish at 20 the government is expected that current economic condition due to COVID-19 pandemic will be normalized soon. An economy will recover like V-shaped and projected growth 2021 is higher than the world's 5.4% and India's 6% but equivalent to China's 8.2%. So broad money and private sector credit growth targeted 15.6 percent per broad body and 13.8 percent per uh, private sector growth if you see here look the, this is the broad body growth so it's actually 12.7 percent it is a previous year it was program 13 percent projection for current account balance if it is used for 1.9 billion an average inflation rate projected is 5.04 to 5.93 to multiply targeted 4.9 percent for the year 21 which is 4.8 percent is the previous year and the repo and reverse repo are proposed to reduce 4.7 percent to 4 percent and respectively for the existing 5.25 percent to 4.75 percent net a foreign asset is expected to grow at 12 percent in first half of initial 21 and 5.8 percent for the second half 
the same in June 20 the net foreign asset grew by 10.2 percent here the net uh, foreign asset growth is the actual 10.2 percent of the previous year uh, that was uh, June 20 and uh, program that was 4.2 percent so if you see here is that two-year growth here that uh, foreign asset is growth for financial 10.2 percent is a program for december 20 12.5 percent uh, uh, june 21 is a 5.8 percent and the uh, net uh, domestic asset uh, is to 20 13.4 percent uh, the program for uh, december 20 14.4 percent domestic credit 13.7 percent and now 15 percent and credit of public sector including government at 53.3 percent and now 35.6 percent and projected june 21 44 by 4 percent and credit to private sector it was uh financial at 20 it is 8.6 percent uh it's uh projected december 11.5 percent and june 20 it would be 14.8 percent is the projected and money supply broad money that means 12.7 percent at 14 percent and june 20 15.6 percent and money multiplied it was in the financial at 20 it is 4.8 percent now the december 20 is 5.1 percent and projected for june 21 is the 4.9 percent so domestic credit is actually 13.7 percent is the previous year and also is the public sector credit growth it was 53.3 percent actual last year we see the private sector credit growth actual growth what 8.6 percent in june 20 the private sector credit growth we see here indonesia 2.7 percent and bangladesh 8.6 percent vietnam 9.6 percent uh, where uh, india 6.3 percent sri lanka 5.9 percent uh, pakistan 5.9 percent uh, overview of global economic growth uh, as per the Ju as per june 20 look here is the is the, is the world this doing 20 it was actual uh with the 19 2.9 and the 20 it's a minus 4.9 it is the projected and uh difference from the january 20 with the projected at minus 8.2 so it's increased it here and advanced economics it was a minus eight is projected for 20 eurasia minus eight Eurasia minus 10, other advanced economy minus 4.8, emerging market and developing economy minus 3, and China 1, India minus 4.5. It is the uh, projected for 21, is the similarity uh, based on the January's change in the figure here. And if you see the global food and uh, rice price indicators and the rice and food and also we can say commodity price indicator and uh, long-term interest rate of some selected countries if we see here look at this line is uh, for india and also say the policy rate of some selected countries china in the us uk japan europe countries and uh, also in the monetary policy uh, the mps of 2021 they are highlighted a 12 month average cpi inflation look here is the generally the 5.65 percent in the june 20 and the food is 5.52 percent and a non food is 5.85 percent and a core is 5.76 percent a same of 12 month ever is general cpi inflation and the upper brand is and uh, june 20th if, the, if you see the base here the lower it would be lower would be uh, june 21 is 5.04 percent and five percent is the june 22 upper one 5.93 percent and also june 22 it would be 5.94 percent moment of surplus liquidity this color is cbs is this color make a uh, pcbs is here this yellow color conventional pcb and the total line is here that june 20 1396 billion taka and movement of call money and policy rate in june 20 is a wrap 5.25 percent reverse wrap 4.75 percent all money 5.01 percent nominal interest rate landing rate in june 20 
7.95% and the deposit rate 5.06% and also real interest rate landing at 1.93% deposit rate minus 0.96% trend of deposit and advance growth is that a deposit growth of March 20 11.21% and advance growth 10.54% so cross country real rending rate if you see here is bangladesh 1.93 percent indonesia 7.8 percent sri lanka 4 percent india 3.6 percent pakistan 2.6 percent vietnam 1.3 percent if we're on the lord side the bangladesh is number uh, second one so cumulative export growth if you see july to june it's 10.5 percent in the financial year 19 and 20 it was minus 16.9 percent so cumulative import growth also in 19 it was 1.8 percent and in july to june in 20 in minus 8.6 percent balance of payment highlights if you see here is the actual for uh, financially uh, 20 current account balance minus 4849 million usd and overall balance positive 3655 million USD and outlook that we projected for uh, financial year 21 it is 1250 million USD months of import of goods and service 6.4 is the actual for financial 20 and the same is 6.4 for the year 21 so cumulative remittance growth if we see in the year 19 it was 9.6 but financially 20 it is 10.9 percent so key item of monetary program is net foreign asset it is a june 2010.2 program for december 2012.5 and june 21 5.8 net domestic asset june 13.4 percent and december 2014.4 percent june 21 18.3 percent domestic credit it was 13.7 percent at the june 20 and december 20 it would be 15 percent june 21 19.3 percent projected a credit to the public sector june 20 53.3 percent and december 20 it would be 35.6 percent projected and june 21 44.4 percent credit to the private sector 8.6 percent in june 20 and projected for december 20 11.5 percent and june 21 14.8 percent broad money 12.7 percent it was uh, june 20 but december 20 at 14 percent and june 21 and it would be 15.6 percent reserve money 15.7 percent in june 20 december 20 15.5 percent and june 21 13.5 percent and money multiplier it was june 4.84 december 20 would be 5.11 and june 21 would be 4.93 and if we see the implication of monetary policy change in 2021 so the monetary policy change is a both accommodation attending a monetary target will be extremely challenging due to covid 19 and seasonal flood etc so it is uh, that a liquidity scenario of banking sector is also expected to remain better due to the reduce of policy rates and a public sector growth target uh, as set for the rate 44.4 percent which is significantly higher than the private sector guided growth an npl banking sector such a once your is so as uh, the npl sme sector and Bangladesh Bank here uh, gives some facility on and offer for credit guarantee. All the state-owned banks are working with this. An increase in the inward remittance inflow of higher FDI. We need the sustained growth. And uh, government managed to maintain inflation rate 5.65 percent against the targeted uh, 5.50. Percent. Uh, it happened due to the price reduction of oil price and also other commodities price in the international market.
So, a Bangladesh bank is working proactively with Securities and Exchange Commission to develop a favorable capital market. Already, Bangladesh bank has taken few initiatives from the improvement of the capital market, like relaxation of capital market, investment limit of banks. Decided to provide a special fund worth of uh, two billion taka to each bank to invest in capital market. Implement a new dividend policy for banks to disburse up to 30% dividend, including 15% cash dividend, subject to maintaining minimum 12.5% capital conservation. And introduce a long term wrapper policy and other initiatives to increase the liquidity for the capital market also. So, in Central Bank has used is available monetary policy instrument we know is a crr a rapid facility refinancing facility and to inject necessary liquidity in the market all these policy measures are taken to help general employment opportunities in the agriculture industry and service sector so that pandemic related economic losses are rapidly recovered so monetary stimulus package declared by the Bangladesh Bank, we know, repo rate reduce, CRA reduce, ADR increase to 87% for commercial bank. It was previously 85% and 92% for Ashuria banks and previously it was 90%. Allocation of total amount of BDT 552.5 billion for different refinancing scheme. So if you see here, it is 5.25 and for June 20, 4.75. Wrap rate, it was 4.75 now 4%. CRR 4% remain. And SLR including CRR 17%. Bank rate it was 5%. Now it is 4%. So thank you. Only highlights MPS highlights for 2020 2021 and just basic highlight for you. Thank you all. So thank you. It's all for today. We'll meet with you again with my next module. Till then, take care. Allah Hafiz.